everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel today we are going to talk about two bags that has been a part of a spring summer collection and a lot of you loves this collection and there are two bags that has more comments of requests of um, having a video about it and also personally I think that this is a two practical bags that you can have or add to your collection I put them both in one video because I think there's not much to talk about each bag for one video so uh, I just put them together so at least you can have two bags in one sitting you can know about two bags in one sitting so uh, the two bags that I'm going to talk about is the vanity chain pouch and the pochette tree set let me just uh, check again the name of this bag sorry it's pochette tirette <laughs> sorry my, my memory is not that good so this pochette tirette and um, vanity chain pouch is the one that we're going to talk about and uh, if you are interested into these two bags please uh, just watch until the end if you are new to the channel my name is Murphy and currently I'm recording this video I am a sales advisor here at Louis Vuitton Singapore and this channel is all about Louis Vuitton products Louis Vuitton updates luxury brands in general so if you are into this kind of thing please do not forget to subscribe okay so the first one that we are going to talk about is the vanity pochette the vanity chain pochette this is one of the bags that has been very very sellable during the fashion show that we had uh, last weekend in Nian city store and a uh, vanity bag has been very is one of the most popular bag in the past few years because of its cute feminine look and now it comes with a smaller version and uh, it's funny because when I first look at it I thought it looks like the can of the spam and that's literally how the shape is like but it's not in a bad way it's just that that reminds me of it um, the space of the bag is actually very good because you can still fit all your essentials inside that's the first one I'm going to talk about just for a change Mama Joyce and I actually tried to put a um, card holder. It's a coin card holder from Men's, but uh, it can be um, a compact wallet. Any compact wallet will fit inside, not a long wallet at all. There's no chance for your long wallet. And uh, my iPhone. If you're using a Pro Max, it can still fit inside because it's still very spacious. As you see, there's still a lot of space inside it. So um, basically, you can actually just put all your essentials inside despite of it being smaller than the vanity bag it still is a very very practical small bag the accessories that comes with it is this uh, bag charm no sorry key charm this is a cute key charm with the LV embellishment on it with the LV embellishment is it called embellishment uh, yeah let's just call it embellishment on the bag tag you cannot do a uh, hot stamping anymore because we need a flat surface for hot stamping unless it's a pure leather we can put a hot stamping on your bag charm but i assume this is nicer than hot stamping don't you think so the accessories that comes with it are the chain and the strap the chain is entwined with a leather which is uh, you can you you also see it in a couple of bags with louis vuitton um, and uh, of course the back tag and uh, the leather strap that is adjustable so you have options of wearing it this is how it looks like with a chain this is me I'm five feet tall and uh, you can wear it as a shoulder carry I'm not a fan of the shoulder carry I don't know why I think this bag will look cuter as a crossbody bag or a handbag so with the chain I would still highly suggest to carry it as a uh, handbag I'm sorry I am recording it by myself so it's it's hard to to shift but this is how it looks like when it's uh, carried as a handbag it is really cute not a practical way to carry a bag but the best way for me uh, the best look for it is a handbag the next one is a crossbody bag as I mentioned it's cuter as a crossbody bag than a shoulder carry with a chain I like it because it instantly shifts from being dressy as a handbag and uh, being casual as a crossbody bag it also comes with a lock although the lock is not very useful to be honest for casual bags like this but most people use it as a bag charm as an accessory of the bag so it's a plus point 
the price of it is 3700 it is a good price for a new bag because nowadays the bags are 4000 to 5000 in luxury brands in general you you will hardly see a bag that is 3000 plus so i think i mean in my opinion it's still a good price i will tell you my opinion about this bag um, later but let's move on now to the pochette tirette uh, which is a new pochette in the store and a lot of people likes this look um, this is very similar to pochette accessoire and uh, of course pochette, pochette accessoire is a legend uh, nothing can beat that but i would say that this is a fresh look for a pochette bag as you can see this is very very similar to a pochette accessoire bag it's in full can it's it's in canvas and uh some vvn on the side the tab in front is also vvn leather and the shoulder strap is also vvn leather if you are one of the people that has a problem with the vvn leather getting darker having water stain you shouldn't get this because um it's kind of inevitable once you um have the vvn leather whether you use it or not it will change color but uh yeah you just have to accept that this is part of the journey with the bag all this uh wear and tear of the vvn leather if you want you can go for the vanity chain pochette it doesn't have a vvn leather at all that's a perfect bag for you if you are yeah really concerned about the vvn leather one uh, cute thing about this is the logo on the side it has this lv circle on the side and the logo another logo uh, embossed on the other side of the bag uh, such a little details like this actually adds up for me <laughs> if i'm buying a bag and uh, the strap is very very similar to pochette as why you have that um how do you call this you have that loop on the other side and then on the other side is attached to the leather so the disadvantage of this is that you cannot really detach it and uh, use a longer strap Louis Vuitton very smart you have to buy a new bag for for your shoulder carry but uh, yeah it's designed to look like it's detachable but it's not there's no way that you can remove this um, strap and uh, change it it also comes with uh, a lock that I say that you can actually uh, use as an accessory of the bag it is not very useful to lock your bag especially day-to-day -day bag I don't see the point of locking it but as an accessory actually this is uh, this is quite useful it looks cute with the bag uh, for what fits inside I put two card holders and one uh, phone inside and you can see how spacious it is still if you're using a pro max it still can fit in so it's really very much the same space as your pochette says why it's just a little bit wider more space so uh, yeah it is still practical this is how it looks like when worn <laughs> no one can tell that this is the pochette tourette uh, from the front unless they see the side so uh, yeah a little breath of fresh air a little uh, uniqueness on the design but yeah it's it's not very outstanding if that's what you're looking for the price is a 2840 2840 a very good price for a handbag nowadays it's hard to get a luxury handbag with this price so i think it's still okay if you're gonna uh, compare it to the pochette accessoire which is the new version it's 2250 um, because now the pochette accessoire comes with a chain as well and a strap that is a uh, longer strap so uh i guess it's still it's comparable but a uh, newer version of course the price is a little bit higher now overall my opinion about this two bag is that it is it is not something new it is not uh, something that excites me because it has been done before it's just a different version of each uh, if i'm going to choose between the two, this two i would go for the vanity chain pochette because you have a lot of ways to wear it compared to the pochette tourette i like a bag that is practical and small because i am short <laughs> small size so uh vanity trunk va sorry vanity chain pochette the best bag if you are looking for a cute bag that is a head turner because the shape is pretty unique it's full monogram it's recognizable as louis vuitton um i must admit that this is not an iconic shape of louis vuitton because a lot of 
brand that I don't know if I can mention because you know I'm still working with Louis Vuitton but a lot of other brands and uh, specifically one brand is doing it and quite popular about it but if you want a Louis Vuitton version of it this is a perfect one I would go for this compared to the vanity bag which is the old version because it's kind of too bulky this is perfect this is slim but still can put a lot of things inside so yeah I think between these two I would go for the vanity chain pochette for the pochette red, I think there's really nothing special about it. Uh, if you want to pass the pochette accessoire, this is the best option. It has more details to it, a more, I don't know, maybe effort on making the bag compared to pochette accessoire. Um, I think it's a perfect gift for people who are just uh, starting their collection. Uh, it, it's an easy grab and go bag if you're going to the supermarket and uh, you just need your wallet and your, your small wallets or your cards and your phone, then that's it. This is a very practical bag for going on the go. But if you want a fashionable, fashionable bag, go for the vanity chain pochette. So that's all I can say about this video. I hope you enjoy each and everything that I showed and I hope it makes you, it helps you with your decision of which one to get. The best option to do is to go to your nearest store and try it and see how you feel about the bag. That's the best thing that you can do because at the end of the day, it's you and it's your bag, it's your style and don't listen to whatever other people say. You know yourself better, so decide for yourself and uh, be happy with your purchase. So that's all I can say about this bag. If you haven't followed me yet on my TikTok and my Instagram, here are the links and the name. And although I'm more active in YouTube, so please subscribe if you want to be updated with the latest and the hottest collection in the store. And uh, yeah, I will see you on my next video. I have to go now because uh, it's in the afternoon and I didn't do any houseworks yet. If you can see, I think my house is a little bit messy. But yeah, thank you so much for all your support on this channel and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!